Before compounding and reconstituting a sterile product, make sure that you have undergone proper hand washing, garbing, and hood cleaning according to the USP 797. Once you have collected all materials needed, wipe each item with sterile 70% isopropyl alcohol and arrange them in a staggered position, making sure they are 6 inches inside the approved primary engineering control hood. Pop off the vial caps and wipe the top of each vial from back to front two to three times with sterile 70% isopropyl alcohol. Unwrap syringe and needle, making sure not to cross in front of first air, and attach needle to syringe. Do not touch any critical sites and make sure you are working 6 inches inside the hood at all times. Uncap needle and place cap on alcohol pad with opening facing first air. Draw up about 5 milliliters of air and inject into diluent vial with the bevel end of the needle up first at a 45 degree angle then down at a 90 degree angle. This is to prevent coring. Lift vial up with needle still in vial, invert and draw up required amount of diluent into the syringe. Make sure not to block first air or touch any critical sites. Tap on the vial with the needle still in the vial to get any air bubbles out that may be present. Remove needle from diluent vial and inject the diluent into vial containing the medication in powdered form in the same fashion as diluent with the bevel facing up initially at 45 degree angle and then at 90 degree angle and expel diluent into the vial. Remove syringe and place on alcohol pad, making sure the needle tip is facing towards first air. Invert medication vial back and forth until the powder has been dissolved. This may take a few minutes. Drop desired amount of air into syringe and inject into the medication vial as explained previously. Lift the vial up with the needle still in the vial and draw desired amount into the syringe. Make sure to tap the barrel of the syringe to get any air bubbles out. Again, make sure that critical sites are not touched and are facing first air at all times. Carefully recap the syringe and place on alcohol wipe with needle facing first air. And that's it.